Hey guys, what is going on? It is Matt from Fit Doty Gaming TV and welcome back to the stage, your San Diego Padres here in sunny San Diego, taking on the Pirates here on MLB 15, the show on the PS4. Francisco Liriano and Ian Kennedy going at it today. Beautiful day in San Diego. You see there the lineup for the Pirates, of course, Andrew McCutcheon, always dangerous. Ian Kennedy takes the mound for the Padres. Going 4-1 uh, and one so far this year with the 2.59 ERA through 9 games with 45 strikeouts. So here we go. Starling Marte hitting 305. Fourth pitch of the at-bat coming. And this one is into right center. It's going to fall and it is going to the wall. Starling Marte has got to possibly three with his speed. He is around second and he is in at third with a leadoff triple. Wow, not a good start from Kennedy. He'll have to make up for it here with Harrison at the plate. But this is driven into right center, and that's going to fall. That will score a run, and Harrison has himself a double. Ian Kennedy looking extremely shaky here to start things off as we're already down 1-0. Now we have two outs. Harrison goes to third. Neil Walker up. 3-1 pitch is hit up the middle for a base hit. And now it's 2-0 Pirates. RBI single for Neil Walker, and wow, that is just awful. Trying to get out of the inning now, and oh, man. Will Middlebrooks not helping out his pitcher. Kennedy is that one he mishandles and can't even get the batter out at third, or at first, as we'll have to get out of it now with runners at first and second. I think this should do it, possibly, and it will as Matt Kent makes the catch. Man, that was a rough first inning for the Padres. Already down 2-0. We're going to have to get something back here. As the Pirates have two runs on three hits. Here is the Padres lineup. We are going with Will Myers leading off instead of Escobar. We're just kind of switching around to see what is happening and see if anything good happens at that. Francisco Liriano is on the mound today for the Pirates. Four and three so far off the 218 ERA and 67 strikeouts. Will Myers leading off. We'll see what he can do so far in this one. Uh, it is down, we're down to nothing, but you know, we have plenty of time and Will Myers is obviously acknowledging that as he gets a leadoff single here for the Padres in the first inning. Now Justin Upton up to the plate, two outs, and Kang with a nice throw over to second for the out, and that will end the inning. So, down to nothing. Kennedy has to have a better inning now as he is going to start off pretty well, getting a strikeout here. Uh, I believe that might have been Liriano. I'm not sure, though, as now Starling Marte is at the plate. And that pitch is inside for ball four. So Ian Kennedy allows another base runner. But with two outs, hopefully he can get out of it. Josh Harrison already up to bat. They've already been around the order. 3-2 pitch is hit into center. That's going to drop for a hit as Marte is coming home with his speed. The throw is good. And it is not in time. Marte finds his way around the tag. And it is 3-0 Pirates. Wow. Andrew McCutcheon up to the plate here. He is getting this one in the gap. Left center this time. And Ian Kennedy is looking awful. Harrison coming around from third. Not even a throw. And it is 4-0 Pirates. Oh my goodness. Jed Jerko strikes out. This is total domination. I... Realize the Padres are doing good, but it is not looking good at all. We're bringing in Despagne to start out the third. That is it for Ian Kennedy. Goes two innings. It allows four runs on five hits, I believe. So here comes Despagne on the mounds, getting a strikeout. That is what we need. We need him to have a shutdown inning here as he is one out away from doing so. 3-2 pitch is on the way, and it is hit over to second. Jed Jerko fields it. And that is the inning. So finally, we get a shutdown inning here. This time from the bullpen. We're going to have to uh, go pretty deep in the bullpen today, which sucks. Because Ian Kennedy could only go two innings. 
as this is a ball hit up the middle by the Pirates for a base hit. Uh, hopefully we, we don't allow an extra base hit. And with the full count, this one's hit into right. Camp is there. A weird route to it, but he makes the catch. So where he's out of the inning there as the Pirates have now four runs on six hits. Here comes Justin Upton up to the plate, trying to get us going with something here. And he hits this one into right center. This could fall, or this could keep going and leave for a home run. Justin Upton saying, you know what? We got plenty of time to come back in this game. Yeah, we're down 4 nothing, but he inserts a little juice into this Padres lineup with a solo shot into right center, and that is just what we needed. So now it's 4-1 as Thayer comes in and leaves with a bang, getting Neil Walker to strike out there. I don't know why he's so mad because they're up 4-1, but uh, that's going to happen. Middle of fifth now, Jed Jerko up to the plate. One, two, pitch. No one on, no one out, and he's taking this one into the gap. Left center, that's going to fall. That's going to hit the wall. Jerko's not the f most fleet of foot, but he will make it to second with a double. So he's in scoring position. Let's try to get another run home. Well, why not? Why not? I mean, it would make sense, right? Try to cut their lead in half. Derek Norris up to the plate. 3-2 pitch. Is hammered into left. Stay fair. Gone. That just hit the top deck in the left field build building. Derek Norris with a two-run shot to left. And all of a sudden, the Padres have lots of life. They are only losing by one run. It's now 4-3 on the two-run shot by Derek Norris. Dino up to the plate, smacks this one. Look where this goes. The third balcony on that brick building in left field. Oh, my goodness. That was a shot, and now it is 4-3 Padres. They are not giving up. Sean Kelly coming into the game now, like I said, digging into this bullpen. As now this is a double play ball. Jerko Escobar Alonso, easy as that as the double play is converted and now there's no one on base well now there's someone at first once you pitch is a strikeout as kelly gets out of the inning with no runs liriano getting struck out now as matt kemp will come up to the play with the runner on first as he will hit this one into right field for a base hit so now there's runners on first and second for the padres they could tie it up here with a base hit clint hurdle the manager for the pirates not happy at all and he's going to take out his starter Francisco Liriano, who looked good to start things off, but all of a sudden allows three runs, and the Padres are right back in it. They're bringing in Jared Hughes, who's 2-1 and one on the year, as this is Justin Upton taking this one into right center as the right fielder, Polanco, is back, and he makes the catch. The runner from second will tag. So now there's runners on the corners for the Padres. First and third. Middlebrook's up to bat, and he is popping this one up into right. Polanco is under it. And he'll make the catch. Runner tagging from third. Not even a throw home. The Padres have tied the game 4-4. Will Middlebrooks has sack fly to right. He gets it done. This game is all knotted up, folks. Never say never. Nick Vincent coming in now. Top of the eighth, trying to close things out. And he is on his way to doing so. Alvarez is struck out. They'll bring in Corey Hart now. This is in the ninth inning, trying to close things out. And he gets another strikeout. Corey Hart, the pinch hitter, is down on strikes. And we will move to the bottom of the ninth here for the Padres. They have come back and tied this game up as they'll bring in Camin Caminero. Caminero. I'm not even going to try to pronounce that first name. Anyways, Middlebrooks up to back. He got the sack fly in the seventh, I believe, to tie things up. And he's going to get a base hit here up the middle. So a great start here in the bottom of the ninth for the Padres. We'll see what we can do with Will Middlebrooks on base. And that'll bring Yonder Alonso up to bat with two outs. And this one is past the catcher. And that is going to allow Middlebrooks to advance to second. So we could win it here with a base hit. Yonder Alonso hits this one in the center. But Andrew McCutcheon makes the catch. We're going into extras. You know what? That is okay. Down 4 nothing after two innings. We fight back, tie the game up at four. We are in the 10th. Bringing in the closer, Craig Kimbrell, who can't get a save here. But we're so deep into our bullpen, we need all the help we can get here as he's pretty much the only person left, I think, besides like a 56 overall reliever. That's the base in the left, not what we wanted. Runners on first and second now, and I'll get a strikeout here getting Alvarez. He is always striking out as it is another strikeout. Two outs now for Kimbrel. Can he get out of the inning? Yes, he can. 
Beautiful strike out there, and we are headed to the bottom of the 10th here at Petco Park. Man, this is a good game. Will Venable into pinch hit. We'll see what he can do here with no one on, no one out. Leading off the inning, and he gets a base hit. I don't know if they're going to rule that, but he is on first base. And I think that was a base hit, in fact. So he gets on there. A great start. Will Myers up to bat, and he gets a base hit up the middle. So another great start. Runners on first and second for the Padres. We'll see who is up next. As it's Escobar hitting this one into right. That could score a run, but we're going to hold the runner up at third. Okay, here we go. Base is loaded. They're bringing in Brad Lincoln to try to save this game. Base is loaded. And guess who's up to bat? Matt Kemp, two for four with two singles. Can he get his third single of the game? No one out. Base is loaded. Base hit into right field. That wins the game. Matt Kemp, the walk-off hero. And the Padres have completed the epic comeback. Down 4 0 after two, they come back, tie the game up, go to extras, and win it in the bottom of the 10th. Derek Norris is the player of the game for that huge two run homer. And wow, you just cannot say enough good things about this Padres team right now. So good on so many levels. They win this one 7 4. They're going to count it as three runs because it was a bases clearing double. But Kemp is the winner. We end up with more hits than the Pirates. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, leave a like. Make sure to subscribe. And you know the deal, guys. Peace.